Hey guys, free pick time. All right, back with another free play. So we picked up yet another winner yesterday, guys, on a no sweat again. Back-to-back -back no sweat wins, and that is how we like it. We don't need to be prematurely aging ourselves over this sports betting business. All right, so as you can see by the backdrop behind me, guys, I am back in the frozen Arctic Tundra, better known as Canada, and I have an NBA play for you guys today. We've got another busy day in Masterclass. If you're interested, guys, to join, it's $99 for an entire month. Doesn't matter what day you join. You get my full card of picks every single day. You get all the Masterclass educational videos that include a ton of the systems I use to make these picks every single day. And you get the Bender Wins Guide to Professional Sports Betting to make sure you're doing this the right way. There is an absolute right way and a wrong way to be betting on sports. And if you're doing things the wrong way, guys, you're really running an uphill battle. All right, BenderWins.com if you're interested. We're going with Charlotte and Detroit over 225. Now, for once, Bovada is useful for something. You guys know I'm not a big fan of Bovada. They have a line at 224 and a half, so shop around. I got three systems on this game coming at 55 to 62%. I've capped this line as being off by two and a half, all the way maybe up to three points on this game. Now, the money distribution is very interesting here, okay? It looks nice on the surface, and I do like seeing it because it is a clear indication that there is sharp money on it. However, NBA is just about the only league slash sport where this kind of money distribution can scare me a little bit, okay? So it's 54% of bets, 80% of money. So when we look at that, we can see that 54% or basically half the people betting on this game are going to the window and betting the over and half are betting the under, right? 80% of the money is on the over, okay? So that is, again, a good indication. Even though there's only 50% of the people betting it, the 80% of the money is an indication that that is sharp money, okay? These are people betting large amounts. These are not the small $500, $100, $1,000 bets, okay? This is moving serious digits all right um now what would i find scary about that nba and i've talked about this before nba is that one sport where when you start getting up to 70 75 80 percent of the money on one particular side you see a lot of weird and interesting things happen okay and i've seen it time and time and time again so these kind of money distributions i would love to see something like this in hockey baseball we always prefer a contrarian money distribution where it'd be like 25% of bets and 40% of money. That means when we win, Vegas wins. But this is hard to ignore. I've capped the game as a two and a half to three point edge. Got three systems on it. Little bit weary about the fact that 80% of the money is on this side, but there is value here, guys. Benderwins.com for the full card. Best of luck.